In this week's Pay It Forward segment, we meet a Utah family that is feeling the pain of loss after losing a sister and a daughter to breast cancer. Christy Anderson's family wanted to help others who are facing difficult cancer treatments, too. Yeah, they even helped our own Mary Nichols here at Channel 2. So tonight, we introduce you to the Rack Pack. She fought really hard, went through all of the treatment that you possibly could. Unfortunately, it came back, you know, kind of with a vengeance. Sarah DeFore remembers her best friend and sister, Christy. Married, kids, young kids. Christy fought breast cancer twice before losing the battle three years ago. I didn't really think that it would come back. I thought we were kind of done with it. That's the news no one wants to get. That's your worst case scenario, right, is that it's back. and. It's not going away. During her painful treatments, Christy never gave up hope. Her focus during her treatments, especially during chemotherapy, seemed to be to make the people around her more comfortable. And after her death, Christy's family decided to continue her passion for helping others. The little list is right here. So we make these care bags. They're called love handles. These bags are packed with love. There's kind of everything, and we fill them up as much as we possibly can. Blankets, pillows, treats, information on local resources, and messages of hope. Give them a little love, you know, and just kind of help with their journey with breast cancer. Hundreds of these love handle bags have gone to local hospitals and support groups providing relief during treatment. If you would have asked her, um, what would you do? What, what would you do if you're not going to make it through this? You know, and she would say, I would help all those girls who are. Christie's family would like to spread the rack pack to other hospitals. Maybe we can help. Sarah, meet Marshall Papke about an America Credit Union. We have a program called Pay It Forward. Oh my gosh. And we give $500 to those who are making a difference in the community and appreciate what you're doing for those who are in such a traumatic time in their life. Thank you. Time, so Thank you so much. Always keep your hope. Even if things seem like they're not going to go well, to always keep the hope up. You know, make them laugh. Live every single second you have to the fullest. Yeah, we have one of the uh, the love handle bags here that they. Uh, Those are really nice. Yeah, and there's so much there's so much in them. A lot of love in these bags. I mean, they're items, but there's a lot of love and uh, there's a lot of things, very useful things that these patients can use over the course of their treatments. So it's, it's really, it is a kind of a gift of love to, yeah. for these people that are suffering through this. So. Yeah, I'm sure that's touching for them, just the fact that somebody yeah. thinks enough of them to drop something else. You know, and if you want to help uh, put some of these bags together or help them, it, with some of their funding, we have a link on our website. Yeah, just go over to our website, KUTV.com, and then click on the Pay It Forward link. And while you're there, don't forget to nominate someone for a future Pay It Forward segment. Yeah, what a great idea. That's I know, I love it. Congratulations to the Rack Pack. The Rack Pack. For doing good yeah, work. And, and, and many more bags coming, I'm sure. So uh, we appreciate that story tonight. Yeah, great.